like any battle, eco battle and a lucid battle, you go back to the drawing board mm -hmm. and then you look at what went wrong. Okay. After that retrospection, another after a book, you will be able to do the job. You will be able to do the job. You I can do the job of getting the party back to, back to power. Okay. Because so many things went on in uh, our my NDC. You will see the election. Mm -hmm. In December of last year, I wrote a letter to my colleagues in Parliament to explain to them why I think that I should be the candidate uh, they should look at in the next uh, flag bearership race. Okay. And I intend to put my heart in the ring because I believe that her party NDC needs to be reformed and repositioned for 2020 election. Again, the country can be far, far better than it is at the moment. And I believe that I have the ideas, the vision to transform our party, the NDC, to make it a winnable party okay. and also transform Ghana, uh, Manabaya, the 21st century economy that it should be. Okay. Um, we see 2016 about so many things went, went wrong. wrong. Yes, of and course. And it's in the mamu you know. Yes. But sir, after corona 2016, now we are active member of our NDC. Mm. So why couldn't you bring your ideas, ne, with this, you know? I don't know one found support to my mamu to me away, ne. Na uti na siya mamu lusu you, ne, after the person, why are you, ne, na ubeye franka to four, and my woman, son, as her ideas, no. But to me, they are supporting you, no. I'm mamu to me about power being. Well, you wouldn't know that uh, unless I tell uh, me catch you say, me the idea be I'm will be I'm to support here. I was a deputy minister of finance at one stage. Okay. So I had a minister. I wasn't a cabinet minister. I was a deputy minister of trade and industry at one stage. I was not a minister. Okay. So I was not a cabinet minister. I became a central region minister. I was a substantive minister. Again, not a cabinet minister. So there is a chain of commander. What, what dream be I want to mm. for true. Whether it gets to its destination or not, you may or may not know. After you say, oh, I was born more, and your own cool decision, no, was it? Many people bring their ideas together, and a pinging no oil mum pinging, and a under the cabinet, and we decide on which ideas to pursue. Until you have thousand, you can't say, say, it be a why ideas, and then you ain't in a yam far. But then, whichever ideas are abandoned by Fano, you as part of the team, you have to rally behind that. So what the NFA you so I'm following you know, have to rally behind. So these are some of the things, unfortunate things I want government to make. Even if you have the best ideas, they may not necessarily see the you know the light of day. And see, I believe say with these ideas now, they are two year war twenty sixteen election you know, If I become the leader of the party, I believe I have the ideas to transform the the, the, the country and, and get the country to the, as I said, you know, the country that it should be. You will achieve five times, the country can be five times better than it is at the moment. Okay. 2016, Opanya no di mo ni ma ye kani ma penyo ra John Dramani Mahama. Ufi sa ni mo di mo bi na so ni enam so di nkuku ke se sa abre mo anansi se. I must say, when you go to any war na eba bakuma, you look at the soldiers na ekro and battle no, together with the general. Sometimes you need to, you know, change some of the soldiers. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you need to change the general. Mm -hmm. I have come to the conclusion okay. that we need a new start. Okay. We need a new vision. Okay. We need a new skin, which means a new leader. Mm -hmm. And just say, President Mahama, I'm born home as Okay. Okay. President Mahama, there are so many things. And your papa, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sure history will remember him. Okay. But we have come to a point. Mm -hmm. It's a, yeah, yeah, baton, it really. It has come to a point that I believe that the baton should go into another hand mm -hmm. for us to have a fresh start and position ourselves to be a winnable party again. Okay. Uh, so we call ND Samanyokoni Mua. Mm. 
What it is, Sana Yan, a boom, Sabra was where you were me. A hoodie, a BB and boom, America president, you know, can ask him. I said, There's nothing to fear but fear itself. And to be being you are a boom, but a me pele me ndc uh, delegates na ndc amanyeku no wo ma yadwen nzama kakrebi ho i mean first and foremost power na yahwe in 2020 no yahwe power no for what we want the power to be able to change nzama o kodi wa gana yefi the mpp abani akoy sama wo zizi he na sesi ara won to mu mbu manen we want to be able to do this for a long time is it okay or better for us to go with Obia Obutumako only one term? Okay. And now we want somebody who will be able to do more than one term. Mm. These are some of the questions we have to ask. And the election is not about who is well marketed, who is old, who is young. It's an election of ideas. Mm -hmm. We are looking at Obia, our the best vision, the best ideas to move our uh, dear NDC party forward and also to move the country forward. Excellent. It's not a beauty contest. Mm. It's not about who has been, we have two years to an election. Mm -hmm. If some, we get a good candidate and that candidate you know, or they're marketing now, we can market that candidate. That is why we have our elections two clear years before we have the election. So President Mahama has done his bit, in my mind. Okay. History will remember him, but, but it is time for the NDC party to move forward and we need a new candidate to you know <laughs> pursue that well i i i have my doubt that you know the leader we need going forward we need to go backwards for that leader okay. i mean people come and do their bits and they move on obi and you about to solve generation you know, problem nobody can solve all the problems of ghana there's nothing like unfinished business in government okay. you do your bits and you move on for the next person to come and do their bit, mm -hmm. for other generations to come and solve their own problems as they as we go along. Okay, and share your crater be barbon since a dom kuma woman rush with your fee. No, come here, some communion and poor must support a JDM for Mahama. Yeah, be as hard when I come home because also come on, mm -hmm. no receiving peace. No, eh, no, man, come home be obviously. Me come home be I will not be contesting in this election, but I think that there were a few, but. And you're surprising. Okay. President Mahama was our president. Mm -hmm. He was the leader of our party. He is a well-known person who has led the party. So mm -hmm. for me, it's not surprising that people will jump and say that, let's go with him because he's the one who is marketed. What I'm saying to NDC is that, look, let's take a breath. Let's sit back. Let's a proper analysis. Let's look forward that. Is that the right move? In my mind, I don't think so. But it's a party to decide. NDC and may decide on that. But we should take a critical look. Whether the 2020 election, we need a candidate, Obitum, first of all, Marco, two terms. Mm -hmm. Secondly, a candidate who has a vision for the future it's and the about, ideas what, what about that will move. Yeah. <laughs> But first of all, when we come to the party, because party contest in the NDC party needs to be reformed. Okay. NDC party, ah, I'm paying for party party, President Rollins, and colleagues, no. I'm going to party with principles and values. Okay. Over, over, over time, you know, some mm -hmm. principles and values, you know, if you are. Yeah, cool. We have gone off track. Okay. So we need a leader who will put the party back on track. Mm -hmm. And one thing I'm telling me here, only them will put the NDC party back on track on its principles and values, probity, accountability, transparency, and the social justice that we talk about. Secondly, we need to heal the party. We need a unifier. We'll be our other party in our bubble together and get it ready for the next election. Then on the country itself, the next election will be fought on the economy. Okay, the mm -hmm. economic theories in various in Zama says here they have been exposed. As they said that if your fundamentals are not right, mm -hmm. your exchange rate will expose you. Now they say the fundamentals are right, so we don't know why the exchange rate is exposing them. We need someone. As you know, I'm an economist. I understand the economics. Mm -hmm. I have been in. I have worked in government as a deputy minister of finance. Mm -hmm. And I believe that 
Mewa ideas to transform Ghana's economy from the commodity based economy that we are to a much sophisticated economy, which is the industrialized economy. At the moment, method that MPP use to industrialize one district, one factory, I think is a bad policy. Mm. I believe in industrialization, but there's a much better way to do it than the one district, one factory. So this is one thing that I, I want to work on. Education, again, I believe in free education because okay. we believe that as a country, if you are, you are endowed with gold, oil, and zamayewa, how can you say that Obiara or country or benefit from those resources. That's an another free education who endorse it. I endorse the free education. Oh, okay. What I disagree is the method of implementation. Okay. I think that they didn't think through it properly. Right. Free education should be based on our commodities and resources. I will fund the free education with the oil, the, the cocoa, the gold and all that. I will not be overburdened people with tax. Double tracking is a bad idea. We live in we don't live in isolation. We live in a global world. You need yankwala to be competitive in the world. Therefore you can't create an education that is in a way or isolate Yamoframa from the rest of so I, I, I will correct it. And okay. the, the the double track that they are talking about seven years, I will cut it in two years. Oh, okay. Because it's not a good policy. Right. And we need to be able to end it as quickly as possible. And yes, I will lose a whole generation. So that is the difference between me and them and possibly um, people who are, you know, contesting, you know, with me mm. in, in our party. Who's here to abandon Kanema and Penny, Jerry John Rollins, now yeah. on board NDC, Chikakra, Ma Okoka, say, it's more like a principles and accountability. Of course. 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 Na my analysis of, and I'm for analysis, the Nams of Mamu Lucy, you know. Mm. Oh, I mean, of course, you know, Akwala or the Abofraba, maybe a waswa is in our papa no mame or Tiama no can be bichawa. Sometimes we think we know it all. Ukwala Kopima and I was saying Abba back. Satam no Namu will power no, 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 Mm. There were others too who thought that they were old enough to do their own things. Mm. But then in the end, but we are, we are coming back to this. You see, that is the problem. And, I, and that is why Mufra NDC party says here there. Let's sit up and look at things critically. Okay. Because what we did the last time, thinking that things will be better. Mm -hmm. And you're better. Mm. So let's not just go into things again, you know, as if business as usual. Mm -hmm. We need to set up and listen to the silent ma majority. Okay. There's a silent majority that we are not listening to. Okay. Let's do things differently. Mm -hmm. We need a new start, a new leader, mm -hmm. a fresh start, a new vision, a new direction. NDC based on the principles and values Ah, I can watch them see here. Mm. Jerry Rollins, the new group, mm -hmm. was a two on my hand. Men they hand, you never do know. Let's get it back on track. And let's not pretend that we can go with or without someone. We need everyone. We cannot go anywhere without your father and your mother. Okay. Uh, you come on SC, now so, and I'm saying, what's your campaign as in C? Memo, I'm going to NDC 40 to delegate our more show. No, yeah, final message. No, they're my home. It's with your best camera in him. Yo, sure, no, no, Makasa. Yo, Madassipi, um, Kakra, my pen, my country, NDC delegate, ne NDC, I'm a Yakunde. 2020 election will not be an easy election. Yeah, we win election simply because MPP are doing badly as they are doing now. We will win the election only when your president Yehu as a better alternative to the, uh, to the MPP. To do that, you know, we need to position the party itself. The party should be in the right space. For the NDC party to be in the right space and be able to stay in power for a long time, first of all, we need a leader with a vision, a leader with new ideas. It's good to have legacies. But elections are not fought on legacies. Even to me, I can say, any legacy, they ever fight elections on. We fought elections on our legacies and lost. So the election in 2020 will be fought on Azar, Yebayama, Nkrofu, Ochina. 
People want to know what you are going to do for me tomorrow, not what you did for me yesterday. So legacies are good. So let's critically look at who will best win us 2020 elections and beyond. The election is not about who is young, who is old, who is experienced, who is well marketed. The election will be based on the person with ideas, the person who is thinking about the future of the NDC party and the country. They select the right candidate. There should be no insult in this. If somebody will be a contest to be a, it should not be a, a be a other That's what democracy is for. I mean, I worked on the President Mahama. He appointed me. But say we are at some time, we used to you get tools and you start, you know, your own your own um, job or you open your own shop. That is even a credit to the person who mentored you or who brought you to that day. So I have nothing against President Mahama, and I will not do anything disrespectful to him. But it is important that we contest ideas for our party's future and for the country's future. Okay. So please, let's look at things critically and choose the right person for the future of Ghana. Mm. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. I will say for on your young four quick ricket, hey gun. Why you end this my severe journey with Janako and my Cape Coast South about some pistol so na opese o tu franka edema ndc amonyo kono no ene no abo enkomo no ye twi ye huti ye wo aba ye ba enkomo e tosmi enu e jakwa brani abedwafo edebeto aso ye kwa basisi ya